probably pretty good. Okay, and everyone goes quiet. <laughs> Brilliant. <laughs> What is up everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I have a very special guest with me. I'm honored to announce Joel Hansen, Model vs Food, joining me today on this food challenge. We are at the Burger Boys in Port Talbot, Wales, taking on this unnamed challenge. The challenge is three quadruple burgers, a ton of fries, loaded, dirty, and it looks and smells incredible. If we get this down in under one hour, we get it for free, we get a t-shirt, we go up on the wall of fame, we get 100 pounds in cash, and we also get to name this bad boy. If we fail, which hopefully we don't because there's no failures, um, it's 60 pounds, and I would like to avoid that. If you enjoy this video, give it a thumbs up, comment down below if you have anything to add, and if you haven't yet subscribed or followed, do consider doing so before you leave. Also, I'm gonna leave social media links to Joel's channels down below in the description. Go ahead and check him out. He does some incredible food challenge videos. Without further ado, Joel, if you're ready. Yeah, I think I'm ready to rock. It looks really, really delicious. Leah, excited to finally link up. This has been very highly requested. It has. So uh, how about we get started here just momentarily? Yeah, let's get into it. Three, two, one. Let's go. Let's get into it. All right, guys, I have some ketchup here. You know, I love my ketchup. Some very large burgers. And should it be fun? I'm gonna try to like navigate this, not knock my drinks off the table. I'll probably grab this big old burger over here. Definitely a nice size little burger. Miss Leah, how is it? Mmm. It's so good. Juicy. It's so good. Man, that's damn good. A little bit of sweetness. I don't really get much heat, but. Is it supposed to be spicy? Mm. You said mostly, spi mostly sweet, little spicy. Mm -hmm. Very delicious, I'm gonna laugh. All right. It's very good. How does this compare to other bird challenges in the UK? This is pretty good. There are some incredible burger vendors in the UK, and I would say this is probably one of them. Mm. It's like 100% beef, smash patties, pretty brilliant stuff to be honest. I love smash burgers. And these are definitely juicy, that's for sure. We have this next one here. I'm not really sure, this one is uh, lots of bacon and bacon jam. Give that a shot. Whoa, <laughs> all right. I need to be more like that. Bacon. I accept about, flavors. <laughs> talk about bacon. This is a very, very bacon burger. What's this one called? Baconator. The Baconator. <laughs> no trademark on Wendy's or anything. Very delicious though. How does this compare to challenges in America and Canada? So I'd say this is pretty like similar to something you'd see in North America. Mm. The smash burger is very common out there. This is very tasty. Um, a lot of the burgers here I find are quite different in the UK, but these are very like what I call North American. Um, one thing I find in general, generally the challenges in the UK are actually quite a bit smaller than in um, North America. Mm -hmm. Even if like something here is supposed to be like five pounds, it's usually actually five pounds. In the States it's probably more like seven. So take what you will. That surprises me. This is a really, really good burger. Like, I'm not just saying, like, I think I'm just trying to, I'm not trying to talk it up. This is definitely the best burger I've had in the UK. It's pretty good. And I think this last one then should have the caramelized onions, I think. Lots of bacon, or lots of bacon on this one, too. I do have a thing of hot sauce here, I'm gonna try to dig into if I can with one hand. It's so warm in here. A little hot? It's a little hot. Do you want the door open? Yeah. No. No, you not worth it. the noise of it. <laughs> the burger is so rich. A bit of hot sauce at a city, that spice kind of helps really break it up. There's a lot of fries. I don't know how they are. 
These burgers are fantastic though, so definitely a good way to finish. Interesting barbecue sauce on it. Yeah, the, the chicken flavor, the coating on the chicken is, is actually really tasty. Mm -hmm. Now some of the options of sauces we have, one was a blue cheese, the other was a ranch. Um, let me down below if you like blue cheese or ranch. Again, I went with none, but Leah, mm -hmm. Team Ranch over here. I would have gone either. I just prefer barbecue over Frank's hot sauce. That's fair. I've done too many challenges with Frank's, <laughs> and now I just can't even smell it. Yeah, that's a real thing, getting sick of something. So we're just over 10 minutes in. Miss Leah, how you doing? I'm good. I feel this is definitely achievable. I would have liked to do it quicker, but. 100% is achievable. No losers no today. No losers today. Hashtag less than We have to name this. That's true. For the next person that comes in and attempts it. Comment what we should name it down below. <laughs> Also chicken done, Leah is well under her fries. She got her halloumis done. I have those left still. Or chips, I should say. Let's get into these. Get a rock and roll. Okay, last stretch. I have like most of my last burger left. The reason that I did that is even though I don't strategize much, I seem to be thinking too much because Joel's next to me. So I think I'm gonna leave that strategically till the end. Get through most of these fries, maybe dig into some of that, back to fries, back to burger, and hopefully get this done in a somewhat impressive time. But we're already, we're already. We're at 13 minutes, guys. We have a full hour. We're at 47 <laughs> minutes. No one's even completed half of this before. To be fair. Maybe I'm just really hard on myself. I was like, 15 minutes, let's go. It's undefeated. <laughs> it's undefeated. We are 15 and a half minutes in. Going real good. Leah is crushing this. She really only has like a handful of fries left. One burger. I'm pretty much the same spot. Just abs the burger. So we will soon, hopefully, not jinx it, be the first two winners. Mm -hmm. I can't get over how much Joel has actually had to drink. I've probably done two of these, one and a half maybe, but that's crazy. He's been drinking fizzy drinks as well. I'd say I'm going pretty light on the liquids. Yeah. I normally drink a lot. It's too much. Speaking of which. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Excuse me, Martin. Excuse me, guys. Would you ask for another Pepsi Max for me, please? Please? Thanks so much. Leah reminded me I should stock myself back up. <laughs> and I think I'm done right there. Thank you, Leah. I tried to shoot for 19 on the dot, roughly. That being said, we are now just gonna cheer Lee on. She literally finishes, like literally, she has like a handful of food left. So she's gonna get down here momentarily. I have full faith in her. She has a full 40 and a half minutes, guys. She's doing phenomenal. Like I said, no one has even done half of this before. And here you have Leah. Almost done. Less than 20 minutes, guys. So let's, excuse me, tune in. As she finishes up, crushes this thing. <sighs> excuse me. Oh, I did it. I thought I was clear, guys, but I got ketchup on my shirt. Casualties are to be expected. Hey, Martin, Martin, can I get a glass of just ice, please? Yes, please. 
Just ice? Yeah, I'm going to fix you up. You're going to fix me up? Yeah. Good, Good effort. I need fixing up. Okay, we have a tiny, tiny bit left. I'm going to try and compose myself and finish gracefully here. Just a couple bites, Leah. Everybody, give her some oomph. Give her some encouragement down below. <laughs> yeah, get come ahead. in, come give, in. Let's see, go Leah, go. <laughs> Thanks, Fran. Mm. I'm going to hold this on the back of your neck. Mm. If you want, I'll put one down your shirt too. But that should help a little bit. That's perfect, thank you. Yeah, you good? Thank you. You're welcome. For those wondering what I just did, when you're feeling a little not great, if you can shock your system somehow, such as putting ice on your back, maybe in your armpit, it generally can make you feel a little better. Last couple of bites. Last bite, let's go, uh, Leah, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is savage. You're so close, you got this. It's been six weeks since I've done a challenge. That is a long time. It's a long time. Long I feel time. like a newbie. I feel like a uh, rookie. Who's crushing an undefeated burger challenge right now and about to get 100 pounds? Mm. Pay for your gas. Mm. Pay for your gas, guys. Look at that. Here we go. Yeah, woo! There we go, everybody. Congratulations. That was awesome. Thank you. Good job. This right. guy got me through this challenge. Absolutely. That's what I'm here for. Right then, everyone. So that was the Burger Boys Burger Challenge. Unnamed, undefeated, smashed by Joel and myself. Joel managed to do it in 19 minutes. I managed to do it in just over 25, under 25 minutes. That means that we are both winners today. I think Joel should be able to choose the name of the challenge as he did do it in a faster time. Still pleased we both managed to do that today. I don't think I could have got through it if I was sat here on my own. Um, I just wanted to say a massive thank you to you for coming on and doing this challenge with me. It was very encouraging and amazing. Go and check out Joel's channel. I'll leave links to his channel and Instagram down below in the description. That is it from us today at Burger Boys in Port Talbot in Wales. We smashed the challenge we set a record and i'm so gassed i'm so pleased for us if you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up comment down below if you have anything to add and if you haven't yet subscribed or followed do consider doing so before you leave thank you all so much for watching and i'll catch you guys on the next one until next time everybody so cute guys i want to say it was very very good i really enjoyed the food i'm so glad that me and leah could actually make this work um, let us know down below in a comment if you would like to see us eat again together. You know, I mean, hey, it was a, we, we had a nice dinner. What, what, what can I say? Casual, casual dinner. Romantic. That being said, wow. Well, anyway, that's a step up. <laughs> Thanks, everybody. It was a pleasure. It's been a pleasure. Thank till, you very much. Until next time. Until next time.